keyboards working here. Hey there, everybody. Good morning. This is Friday. It's I'm running a little bit late this morning. Sorry about that, but uh, you know issues. So we're gonna get this installment of Free Coaching Friday kicked off right now. Stay tuned. This is Seven Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of Seven Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. And we are back. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Thank you so much for hanging in there, waiting for me this morning. As they say in the biz, we had some technical difficulty this morning. Really, the reality is the laptop didn't want to start up this morning. So I uh, twisted its keyboard, I guess. Can't twist its arm. Uh, into submission. Here we are. Things are working. And by the way, uh, you might be watching on uh, Instagram. I'm running this uh, as an Instagram live this morning. Also, if you are watching on Instagram, awesome. Thank you. Good to have you here as well. Both of you, whether you're watching live or on the replay, if you would do me a favor, just drop a comment in there. Say hi. Say good morning. Let me know where you're watching from. And if you get any value at all from our time together today, be sure and give those uh, thumbs up and hearts uh, to the video. So it's Friday. That means it's uh, usually free coaching Friday. And that's a day where I take questions, take comments, or take leftovers from the week, and we talk about it. Um, if so, if you have a question, be sure and drop that in there as well. Uh, all right, so one of the ideas that we talked about this week was competition, and I want to clarify a little bit because I, I've said for a long time that your competition is whoever's getting the dollar today that you want tomorrow. That's not 100% accurate. It, it's, it's about 80%. But here's the clarification I want to give. It's whoever's solving the problem today, whoever, whomever, or whatever is solving the problem today that you want to solve tomorrow. Now, that's only a, a slight modification, but let me explain. Our job is, as business owners is to solve problems for other people. Hopefully we can do that at a profit, and if we can, then everything's right and right is rain, right? So we have to, other people have to be involved and we have to be solving problems. Well, those problems are being solved somehow now, right? If, if my coffee is getting cold, I solve that problem in a couple of ways. I can go heat it up. I can put a little more in there or I can just deal with drinking cold coffee. Those are my options. So if you can solve that problem for me, right, then you have to displace that solution that's already there. That's your competition. I was in a, a meeting last night with some people who were um, uh, wanting to write a good business plan uh, as a little workshop to help them write a better business plan. And the question about competition came up. We're kind of going around the room. Who's your competition? Who's your competition? To a person, everyone in the room believed that only people doing the thing that they were doing was their competition. Right. So the guy who makes salsa believed his only competition were other salsa makers. I'm like, well, what about hot sauce folks? What about people that use something on the, that use uh, chutney instead of salsa? Right. However, the problem gets solved. That's who you have to displace. All right. So when you're thinking about competition, competition is one of the four parts of your market. Right. When you're thinking about competition, be sure to think broadly enough to cover all of those solutions. And all of this is related to the idea that we have to think about uh, that we have to think about our um, customer first. Have to think about our customer first. All right. That's it. There were no questions that came in today, so I'm just going to leave it there. You guys have a fantastic Friday. What, what are we running at? We're running about five minutes here. That's a pretty good little show. Uh, Abby points out the sounds better here. Thank you so much for that 
feedback, Abby. We're going to keep working on that. Try to get as many uh, good things working here for you as we can. If there's ever anything I can do to help you out in your pursuit of excellence and success, be sure and reach out to me. Find out more about me at TomRigsby.com. You guys have a fantastic Friday, a great weekend. I'll be back here on Monday with another installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. So take care.